Hi, I'm Marty Nemco. I thought it would be fun as an experiment to try to present the history of music in 10 minutes. Even more experimental, uh, I did no rehearsal. I just spat with a cup of, sat with a cup of coffee for about three minutes, thinking about the most iconic kind of music that popped in my head through the ages. And um, now I'm going to try it. I think it's more interesting to see with the beauty marks and, and warts uh, I'm going to do this in one take, and for better or worse, there'll be mistakes, who knows. But anyway, so first thing that came to mind was Bach. Let's see if I can move the keyboard, move the uh, camera here, a little so you can see the keyboard, which is, seems important, I guess. <coughs> I always did think of sterility as associated with some of that Bach. Of course, something like the Hallelujah Chorus from that same era was hardly that at all. So, let's see if I can play with it. The next uh, thing that came to mind as we move up the history of music is uh, Ina Klein and Nacht music for Mozart, so let me try that. Or the other Mozart is a I've got defective fingers, so you can't, can't do classical. Then I think of uh, Beethoven, and so, yeah, we all think of like the Moonlight Sonata. More But he was also, especially as he got older, it got he got much more dramatic. And his, I think that was his Appassionata Sonata, or his uh, no, maybe that was uh, later. But he know him like that. Then I think next of uh, Debussy, Clear to Loom. Next thing that comes to mind is a dramatically different ragtime. comes to mind are old standards like Over the Rainbow. <clears throat>
little bit of jazziness in there, but that makes me think of more jazzy stuff like blues stuff, you know. Like... <laughs> think of the kind of Latin jazz thing that was happening. Uh, first, it, I guess it was uh, bossa nova stuff, so like this. <laughs> traditional Latin, like uh... And then now I'm thinking mix as we move up, we think of show twos, so I think of do a deer, you know, from sound music. <laughs> Yesterday is probably the famous, most famous one. jump ahead, I think the thing that uh, pops into my head most for modern is, I guess, I guess um, oh, I guess there was the, the you know, uh, uh, like, the, I guess before there was the, the classic rock and roll, like, at the hop. <laughs> Think of hip hop kind of a feel, so uh, I can't play that, but this is at least for completeness. <laughs> future going to be like? 
I have no idea, but I thought I would end by playing what I have created and I, I liked. Um, it's a blend of modern instrumentation using this uh, electronic keyboard, uh, but it's beautiful. I think uh, beautiful music has gone lost. There's, there's a lot of edgy music out there, uh, maybe because I'm old, but I think beautiful music has its place. Uh, and so here is something I wrote called Birth. I'm going to play this all the way through. It's about two minutes. I'll play an abbreviated version. about 10 minutes of my history through the world of music and uh, maybe a projection of my hope of what the future music will be like, a little prettier. We live in hard, hard times and some of the music today seems to put even more hardness on people and uh, I like a little bit of this softness. Anyway, I'm Marty Nemco. I hope you liked it. I welcome your thumbs up and accept your thumbs down. I always look forward to your comments and especially like if you hit the share button below. Share on your social media so that my efforts can have broader impact. And I am flattered if you choose to subscribe to my channel. In any event, I do thank you for watching. I'm Marty Nemco.